Hello, hello, hello. What ho! Welcome back to another exciting adventure of Piensas de Viejo. I'm your host, Travis Finley. I was just listening to some Manly P. Hall talking about the soul, and I remembered a conversation that I had with one of my writers about dreams, and it was the guy who, uh, pretty sure it was the guy who was going to see Bruce Springsteen over and over again, but... Anyway, um, the epiphany that I had, and let's see if I can recreate it, the epiphany that I had had to do with the reality of our dream, right? So we, we live in a world right now where there is a cloud above us that we can't see, we can't get to, and yet we send our data to that cloud, okay? Before the cloud there was, I guess, just the ether, right? Uh, Communication with um, fiber optics was uh, included in the ethernet, right? That that, um, etheric place where communication happens that you can't see. Anyway, okay, so look. So, Ready Player One laid the groundwork for this metaverse kind of stuff, right? Where where people from all over the world can upload uh, themselves to a uh, metaphysical, etheric location, right? And be there in their mind not physically, they can put on any avatar they want, make themselves look like whomever they want. But they are there. Well, that's the dream world. When you dream, you're doing Ready Player One. Your mind taps into, goes outside of, and goes into a metaverse where other people are as NPCs in your dream. But then you're in their dream. Do you, that's what happens when, every, when anybody goes to sleep, falls asleep, boom, he's up in the cloud. He's up in whatever it was, the, I can't remember where the place was called in um, Ready Player One. But you get what I'm saying? So then that goes back to the combination of this concept with waking life, where the one dream NPC said, real awareness true awareness is when you realize you're in someone else's dream as an NPC and then you can just be like yeah I'm just gonna go check this place out I'm gonna detach right and then you become self-aware in that dream and then you're able to uh, take advantage of you know those millions and millions and millions of lives that you've lived in your dreams. I don't know. What do you think? Pretty interesting to me. All right. Uh, Thanks so much for checking out another exciting adventure of Piensas de Viejo. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share. Until next time.